For decades, NASA has been studying astronauts' physiological responses to zero gravity, for living in outer space, and to staying in space vehicles and space stations for extended periods of time. NASA recently conducted underwater research, since the environment provides some useful similarities to working in space, using off-the-shelf technology developed by Thought Technology, the world's largest manufacturer of biofeedback equipment. The small device which connects to PCs or records data to compact flash cars is called FlexComp Infinity and records multiple physiological measurements simultaneously. The astronauts, Commander Dave Williams, a Canadian physician, and Ron Garin, an American, wore the gear throughout the day while living in a National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration undersea habitat off the shore of Key Largo, Florida, 65 feet below the surface. NASA researcher William Toscano describes the mission. Our project was called NEMO 9. It was 22 days long with two astronauts participating. They wore the FlexComp Infinity system for three of the mission days. What we were looking for was the effect of isolation, workload, and fatigue on the individuals. We were using the NEMO 9 environment as an analog of a space station. We recorded five measurements, all stored on flash memory cards, heart rate and electrocardiogram, respiration, skin conductance, and temperature, and finger pulse volume. FlexComp Affinity, which weighs less than a pound, is able to do what used to take a full wall of equipment weighing hundreds of pounds. NASA Director of Operation, Bill Toscano, commented, Because of the extremes in the research environment, which included air pressure at 65 feet below sea level, there were questions whether the instrument would function. It did, with flying colors. For more information on Thought Technology's wide range of biofeedback, neurofeedback, and data acquisition products, visit us at thoughttechnology.com.